have you ever seen such a burish man? At the supermarket, he sees food he doesn't like and knocks it over. When he sees something he likes, he just eats it. Men even empty the shelves. When he sees three X's, he just clears them all out. He won't leave until the shopping cart is full. He set up tens of thousands of dollars worth of table lamps as bowling balls, but that doesn't satisfy the man's burishness. So he drove a car full of bowling balls and smashed a million dollar fish tank to smithereens. After having fun, the man went straight to a mansion worth millions of dollars. He used a crowbar to get in without a key, but there was no water in the toilet. So he brought a large bucket of pure water and used it to flush the toilet directly. After a busy day, the man wants to take a shower, so he takes out a whole case of champagne. Each bottle is worth tens of thousands of dollars. The champagne fills the entire pool. The man lies down comfortably and takes a few sips through a straw. It tasted really good, but as the days passed, life became more and more boring because he seemed to be the only man left in the world, having lost the courage to live. The man wrote his tombstone on a stone and drew a bullseye on it. He planned to drive his car into the bullseye to end his last boring life. But just as he reached 120 mph, he suddenly braked hard and stopped right in front of the stone. The man stood on the roof of the car and peered into the distance, his eyes widening in shock. The man took a whiff of his clothes. The next moment he fainted. In the desert, the man saw a wisp of smoke in the distance. He was so excited that he climbed into the car with his hands in a hurry. Where there's smoke, there must be someone alive. The man drove to the place where the smoke was coming from. Sure enough, he saw a tent and hot coffee over a charcoal fire. But what attracted him most was the underwear hanging out to dry. And the smell of it. He was even more intoxicated than winning $220 million and fainted right on the ground. In a haze, the man realized that he was lying in the arms of a beautiful woman and instantly had the courage to survive. However, in a trance, he feels that someone is giving him artificial respiration. It turns out to be the ugly woman in front of him who saved him. The man woke up immediately angry. Hate the woman looks ugly. The woman was enraged. The woman took out a small pistol from her pocket, and the man immediately raised his hands in fear. The woman told him to give her back her clothes. Instead, the man held her dress between her legs. The woman said he was a bad man. The man argued that he was a good man. They shake hands and make up. The woman invites the man for a hot coffee. The man thought that although the woman in front of him was ugly, at least she was a woman. So they soon formed a family with the woman. They lived together very happily. The man was responsible for purchasing things and repairing the plumbing. The woman was in charge of cleaning and housework. However, this peaceful life didn't last long before it was shattered by a sudden accident. They were driving out of the supermarket. They were driving out of the supermarket when they almost hit another car at an intersection. But when the man got out of the car, in the other car, there was a blonde with blue eyes. The man was so surprised that he forgot about the ugly girl behind him. But the next second, The man's car exploded. He climbed into the beautiful woman's car. This is the second woman he's met in the desert. The nymphomaniac man stares at the beautiful woman and can't stop staring. He forgets about the ugly woman in the back seat. The man invites the woman back to his home. The three of them may be the only three human beings left in the world. To celebrate the encounter, the two women hugged each other and the man took the opportunity to move in and hug them as well. The ugly woman invites the beautiful woman to taste the red bean sundae she made. Unexpectedly, the man actually changed into a neat shirt and shaved off his beard. A man is happy when he's happy. With one man living with two women, it's clear that men are in demand. Eventually, the three of them agreed to spend the weekend together. One, three, five and two, four, six. The excited man prepares a candlelit dinner for the beautiful woman and has a big Simmons bed set up. In order to create the atmosphere, he also set off romantic fireworks, but he never thought that his fireworks attracted a supercar. When the person in the car came down, the beautiful woman realized that it was her old flame. So the life of three becomes four, and the pretty girl is obviously very nice to her old flame. The man keeps looking at her through his binoculars from time to time. Seeing their intimate behavior, the man became jealous, so he came up with a bad idea. The next day, he arranged to play tennis with them, but what he saw with his own eyes was so shocking that he was dumbfounded. This is the movie Why, The Last Man. Would you be happy if there was only one man left in the world? 